Welcome back, everyone, to another T Bros Entertainment video. Today, I'm going over absurd and ridiculous Pokédex entries of over three regions: Unova, Kalos, and Alola. So, we're going to start with Unova first, and the first Pokémon I'm doing is Venipede. But before we're doing that, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and don't forget to turn on the notification bell for more videos. So, let's get into it. Venipede. The centipede Pokemon. No duh. Its bite injects a potent poison enough to paralyze large bird Pokemon that try to prey on it. Okay. <clears throat> You've got this little bug thing, and it can paralyze large birds. I mean, like, about the size of an eagle. Wow. So much for defense systems. Alright, the next one I'm doing is Darmanitan. So, it says here, its internal fire burns at 2,500 degrees Fahrenheit, making enough power that it can destroy a dump truck with one punch. So, you got this gorilla looking thing, and with one punch, it can destroy a dump truck. These Pokemon worry me sometimes. Just can't stand it. Alright, next up is Kofagrigus. It says here that grave robbers who mistake them for real coffins and get up too close to them end up trapped inside their bodies. Oh no, that's a little scary. You mistake, a, you mistake this for a real coffin and get trapped in there for eternity. No, thanks. Alright, the next one I'm doing is Frillish. This one's kind of scary. Using the invisible poison spikes on its veal like arms and legs, it paralyzes its enemies and causes them to drown. That's a little scary. Alright, the last one for the Unova region is the Evolution Jellicent. Fishermen are terrified of Jellicent. It's rumored to drag them into the sea and steal their lives away. Mm, that's another scary one. Okay. Next up is uh, <coughs> the Kalos region. So, the first one I'm doing is Chesnaut. Oh, by the way, I have a shiny Chesnaut. So, it says here, its tackle is forceful enough to flip a 50-ton tank. It shields its allies from danger with its own body. Okay, you got this buff porcupine in the shape of a puggernaut. And then it can flip over a 50 ton tank with its own body. Wow. Alright, the next one I'm doing is... Scrope. It says here, camouflage as rotten kelp. They spray liquid poison on prey that approaches unaware, and they finish it off. So, this little thing that looks like kelp sprays poison, and it paralyzes them. Well, not exactly, but it knocks them out. Alright, next one I'm doing is Clauncher. They knock down flying prey by firing compressed water from their massive claws like shooting a pistol. Okay, you got this tiny crab. It can shoot water out of its hand like a pistol, and it can just hurt giant bird Pokemon like the Venipede can. Gosh. Alright, last one for the Kalos region Noibat. And yes, I do have a shiny Noibat. The Sound Wave Pokemon. Interesting. They live in pitch black caves. Like any other bat. Their enormous ears can emit ultrasonic waves of 200,000 hertz. Okay, you got this tiny bat that I have a shiny of. With its massive ears, it can emit 200,000 hertz of ultrasonic waves. These newer generations are just... Ugh. Alright, last one I'm doing is the old region, and then the first one I'm doing is 
the very first starter Pokemon of there, Rowlet. It says here that it feels relaxed in tight, dark places and has been known to use its trainer pocket or bag as a nest. Okay, you got this little owl-looking thing, and it hides in someone's backpack, and when I take it to school, people will be like, Hey, why well, you got an owl in your backpack? You're not supposed to have that in class. And so, this Pokemon is to blame, because it always hides in the person's backpack. Okay. Alright, the last one I'm doing is an Ultra Beast Pokemon, Guzzlord. The Junkabore Pokemon, whatever that means. It, it's an unknown life form called a UB, whatever that means. It may be constantly hungry, so it is certainly always devouring something. Okay, so you got this obese dragon looking thing, and it's always eating something. Yeah, we got Gen 1 Snorlax to Gen 7 Guzzlord. Jeez, he's dying Pokemon. Well, everyone, that'll be it for today's video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and, uh, turn on that, uh, notification bell, and, uh, see you next time in another video.